you are going to listen to four people talking about their favorite room at home. Speaker 1 Robert Hi there. I'm Robert and I'm 20 years old. I live alone in a small but comfy apartment. Let me tell you about my favorite room, my bedroom. My bedroom is not very big. It's just the right size for me. The walls are a soft, calming blue. This color helps me relax after a busy day. I have a cozy bed in one corner where I love to snuggle up with a good book or watch movies on my small TV. Across from my bed, there's a sturdy wooden desk. It's not very large, but it's perfect for studying or working on my computer. I have a comfortable chair that I use when I'm sitting at my desk. In another corner, I have a tall bookshelf filled with my favorite books. I love reading and having them close by makes me happy. Next to the bookshelf, there's a small, round table with a vase of fresh flowers. It adds a touch of nature to my room. One thing I really like about my bedroom is the big window. It lets in a lot of natural light, which makes the room feel warm and welcoming. I also have light curtains that I can pull closed when I want some privacy. In my free time, I enjoy doing a few things in my room. I like listening to music on my small stereo. It helps me unwind and relax. Sometimes I invite friends over and we sit on the floor chatting and laughing. Overall, my bedroom is my favorite place in the house. It's where I can be myself and do the things I love. I feel comfortable and at peace here. It might not be big or fancy, but it's just right for me. What's your favorite room in your house? Let me know in the comments below. Speaker 2 Erica Hi, I'm Erica and I'm 20 years old. I live in a cozy apartment all by myself. Let me share with you my favorite place, my bedroom. My bedroom is not very big, but it's just perfect for me. The walls are painted a soft shade of lavender. This color always brings a sense of calmness and peace to my day. Right in the center is my comfortable bed. It's where I love to read my favorite books and watch movies on my small TV. Opposite my bed, I have a small white desk. It's where I do my studying and sometimes write in my diary. I have a comfy chair that I use when I'm working on my desk. In one corner, there's a tall bookshelf filled with all kinds of books. I adore reading and having them close by is something that always brings a smile to my face. Next to it, there's a little round table with a vase of fresh flowers. It adds a touch of nature and beauty to my room. One special thing about my bedroom is the large window that lets in lots of sunlight. It fills the room with warmth and makes it feel so inviting. I also have light curtains that I can pull closed when I want some privacy. In my free time, I love doing a few things in my room. I enjoy listening to music and watching series on my smartphone. It helps me relax and unwind. Sometimes I just lie in bed and stare at the ceiling for a couple of hours. All in all, my bedroom is my sanctuary. It's where I can truly be myself and do whatever I want. I feel so comfortable and happy here. It might not be huge or fancy, but it's exactly what I need. I simply love my bedroom. To me, it's the most comfortable place on earth. Do you have a favorite room in your house? Let me know in the comments below. Speaker 3 Richard. Hey, I'm Richard, and I'm 20 years old. Living on my own has its perks, especially when it comes to my favorite room in the house, the kitchen. Even though it's not the biggest kitchen, it's just right for me. The walls are painted a warm shade of yellow, which always brings a feeling of happiness and energy to my cooking space. Right in the center is a sturdy wooden table where I love to prepare and enjoy meals. Opposite the table, there's a set of shelves filled with pots, 
pans, and all sorts of cooking utensils. I enjoy experimenting with different flavors and recipes, so having everything at hand is a real plus. I also have a small stove and an oven, which are my trusty companions in my culinary adventures. As you might be thinking, I love cooking. One of my favorite things about the kitchen is the big window that looks out into the garden. It lets in lots of natural light, making the room feel bright and inviting. I've placed a few potted herbs on the windowsill, so I can easily grab fresh basil or mint while I'm cooking. In my free time, you'll often find me in the kitchen, trying out new recipes or putting my own twist on old favorites. I enjoy the process of chopping, mixing, and simmering, and the delicious smells that fill the air. Sometimes I invite friends over for a homemade dinner, and we have a great time chatting and enjoying the dishes together. All in all, my kitchen is my little haven. It's where I get to be creative and where flavors come to life. It might not be a fancy chef's kitchen, but it's perfect for me. Do you have a favorite room in your house? Let me know in the comments below. Speaker 4 Ashley Hi, I'm Ashley, and I'm 20 years old. Living on my own has its special moments, especially when I step into my favorite room in the house, the living room. Although it's not the largest space, it's just right for me. The walls are painted a soothing shade of light green, which always brings a sense of tranquility and calmness to my little sanctuary. Right in the center is a comfy sofa, where I love to unwind with a good book or watch my favorite shows. Opposite the sofa, there's a wooden coffee table with a few potted plants. They add a touch of nature and freshness to the room. I also have a small bookshelf filled with novels and a few cherished mementos. It's like a little library corner where I can escape into different worlds. I love reading books in the living room. One of my favorite things about the living room is the big window that lets in plenty of sunlight. It makes the room feel warm and inviting. I've added soft curtains that I can pull closed when I want some privacy. In my free time, you'll often find me in the living room, curled up on the sofa with a cup of tea and a good book. It's where I find peace and relaxation after a busy day. Sometimes, I invite friends over, and we gather around, chatting and enjoying each other's company. All in all, my living room is my personal oasis. It's where I can be myself, unwind, and simply be. It might not be a big living room, as we are used to seeing in movies and series, but it's exactly what I need. Do you have a favorite room in your house? Let me know in the comments below. Thank you for listening to English Audio Lounge. We hope you have enjoyed it. Stay tuned for more audio stories to improve your listening.